and welcome, Paul here, and I am playing The Last Days of the Third Age, a mod for Mountain Blade Warband, and this is my Ranger series. Now, I was asking if anyone knew what I could do to fix the issues I've got, and what many, well, what a couple of people had said, that because the Dunlander camp is a sub-faction, if Isengard is defeated, then there's a good chance that they're going to vanish. I don't know how true that is. But, um, yeah. So one thing that's worried me, though, is that Isengard is well below the threshold, and it has been for some time, but they haven't been sieged. And I'm wondering if that's because the Dunlander camp is still up. Like, maybe that camp has to be taken out before Rohan will siege Isengard. I don't know. I'm merely guessing. But it makes me worried because I'm going to be in a bit of a, a bind otherwise. So I don't, really don't know what to do. Now, here's the thing. When I did this, I made a copy of my uh, the last game I was using before I did the nightly patch in case there were any issues. But as soon as my save game, I didn't do a new one. As soon as my save game was updated, that was it. And yeah, I can't load my uh, my save on my old uh, version of the game. So I no longer have the patches or I no longer have the option to go back and, you know, forcefully siege somewhere. So yeah, I am in a worse position than I was before. So all I can hope is that if we take these guys out, If we take these guys out, then yeah, that's that's all I can hope for, really. Speaking of taking these guys out. We're a bit outnumbered. I'm hoping that they're just going to come at me. It does make life easier. It certainly makes life easier. Get on the line, boys. Get on the line. Now you need to fire, guys. Because these guys are not going to slow down. Okay, we may be in trouble. Position, hold this position, hold this position. Very bloody fight. Angry. 
I already burned for all my arrows, so... Maybe we can just keep this up a little bit longer. Nope, I am down. Okay, let's back out. Too many of our troops went down. Yeah, that wasn't the smartest fight. Had to give it a go though, had to test the waters as it were. We'll go and uh, recruit. See, yeah, I, I'm not sure what to do. Like, the only thing that possibly enters my mind is to constantly fight. Constantly fight the Isengard forces until Isengard is below the threshold of where they recover, which currently it is... Factions don't regen below 2,000, so once they get below 2,000, they're only going to get weaker and weaker. That's if they def get defeated. I'm going to just increase all this as well, so... You know what? Sie siege Strength Requirements, I don't know what this does. I don't know what Defender Only is. I'm going to set it to None, and we'll see what happens. We'll see if that gives any factions the will to start sieging. Because if that allows us to siege anywhere, then hey, I am down for that. Hell, I wonder. Something that just occurred to me, because I've always used a small amount of troops, so what if I could never siege because I never met a certain strength requirement? Because why wouldn't I be able to siege, you know what I mean? But now that I've removed that requirement, can I... No, no. The answer is no. Don't be silly. What are you talking about, you madman? Okay. We got no more food. Let's go get let's go get some grub. West Osgiliath has been Oh okay, so doing that has just made it so everyone is about to get messed up. Yikes, okay. That's not good. You know with that said though, with that said. We'll leave Isengard for now. We're gonna go back, we're gonna go help. Maybe, just maybe we can jump into some of these sieges. Oh boy. Yeah, this may not have been the smartest idea I've had. If I'm totally honest. But if it means we can get into fights with these guys and fight them as a defender, we're going to mess them up, you know? I'm too busy, mate. Join the battle. 600 versus the enemies. Yeah, not many actually turned up. At least they didn't all get in there, which is fine. They're coming from all sides. take care of this lot. And this is going to be a good way to start bringing down the enemy.
Yeah, this will work. I could always switch it back to defender only. I don't know what it means, but hey. Oh god, all the archers came out. We've got a lot of troops. They following me. Next time I'm not going to have a move. Since these can't physically cross the bridge, I'm going to take them out now. Attacking one, he's got a shield and trying to wear it down. How their shields are still intact is beyond me. Yeah, just this lot left. Kill him. I'm stuck here. There we go. Two shields left, one guy running around like a headless chicken. One shield left, one guy left. some prisoners. It's not over yet though, the rest of them are still here. But I think this is going to be the way to do it. We help defend as they attack and they do their push to take our land. Stay indoors, join the battle. See the way we're doing it is that they're coming out slowly, which is good. I'm just let everyone go do their own thing now. I don't need to run out. See, we have some serious defender strength. But everyone's leaving and I don't know why. friendly troops, whoops. I think it's safe to say that this is going to be defended, no problem. But it's so buggy, everyone just runs out. I'm going to stay here because I'm guessing their reinforcements will come across and I can fight them. They all come from the middle. Oh no, they are coming. Alright then. I can't 
Can't go any further. Yes, I can. Whether or not this is smart, I do not know. <laughs> There's some in the water. these guys. I wonder if I should pull back and let them all get in. That way this fight might go a bit quicker because they've got more troops they're trying to send out. killed most of their troops. <laughs> there we go. Whoever's left though, just took someone down. Oh my god, the influence of rank points I'm getting. Wait, I'm rank 11? That goes beyond that? Well, okay. New to me. I thought 10 was the cap. I wonder what gifts I can get. Let's let them all get in there. There we go. Now we've got some numbers. Now we've got numbers for a serious siege. It's more like it. Now let's bleed them. It's in the forces of Mordor packing. Just like we did Moria. They even getting across the bridge now. Yeah, they can. It's just they. They're worth stopping. Like that. For a reason unbeknownst to me. Are they trying to fight me? Is that what's going on? Sure looks that way. This will also be a good way to bring uh, Gondor's stuff back up. troops fight on. So yeah, this is actually going pretty well. The enemy is dying a lot quicker than before. So yeah, that is going to go well. I'm going to pull back though for now. Oh, I'm going to order my troops to attack. Well, that's not good. Now we are going to take some damage. That was not good at all. We're still victorious, but we took casualties. And I guess we've got prisoners. Makes no difference really though. So West Oscaliath is saved. I'm gonna have to move and help that other place. 
but reports faction so that we, I don't know if that's if it's not updated yet but we damaged them a little bit hopefully that will bring the gondor number up as well anyway that's it for now thank you for watching till next time